situation with this woman taking her daughter out on a play date with her little friend. Check this out right here. Hey, so remember in my last video, I told y'all my baby had a boy name. Let me introduce y'all. Y'all heard that part that popped off? Remember, remember on my last video, I told y'all my baby had a boyfriend. Y'all seen the shirts. I'm with him. I'm with her. She smiling because she had already seen flip factory. So clearly I need to get some thicker flashcards next time. We got signed in at Flip Factory, honey, and I just felt like a third wheel. Cause look at them, like they doing better than me in the little department. And my son-in-law do backflips better than me. They played a little bit of basketball together and they're both trash, let's be honest. <laughs> I watched them for about five minutes and just ever best. Look at that, look at the smiles on their faces. They went over to the beam and he let her beat him three times. And then they took turns carrying each other. Child must be nice. They played a little bit of ice hockey and she was cheating. Then we had to figure out what we was going to eat because I was getting hungry. He picked McDonald's, but you know what? They didn't want that. Well, I took them to Zaxby's anyway. And once they got out of the phone pit, they started to build them a little pyramid, child. And if we're being honest, these nine-year-olds doing way better than a lot of our grown asses. And I told y'all basketball was not their sport. They got lucky on that shot right there. And I told y'all he played football. His I am a whole lot better than hers because she didn't hit not one of them little furry me. And y'all know this game is mandatory at any fun spot. Look at this puppy love, honey. They did everything together. And y'all, he's so sweet. Every time they went to play a game, he always slid his car first. Look at him. Their shirts are the cutest. Shout out to his mama. We wrapped up our trip. We went to Walmart, then to the house, and we out. Notice she said shout out to his mama, not to his daddy. Shout out to his mama, because... <sighs> Let's read some of these comments down here. So this lady says, so let me get it straight. This is a supervised play date. And y'all still got a problem? Yes. Damn, y'all. What's wrong with this? Better than what our, our ass was doing behind our parents' backs. I wasn't doing that shit at nine. What the hell? That's what y'all little fast ass was doing at nine years old. 100% approved. When my kids reach the, the age where they have their little boyfriends, girlfriends, I would love to guide them through it better than my own, um, my own parents did with me. Just because you was fast don't mean everybody else was fast. At nine, I wasn't doing shit. Yeah, you thought about little things, whatever, like play, play. Some people doing little play, play stuff in school. You know, some people be wild and whatever like that. But those people are fast. Because you have to distinguish fast. You have fast and people that's not fast. Some kids are fast, all right? And then you see the repercussions of what fast brings in the future. So, yeah, let's continue. This person says there's proper ways to do things with kids without it being too fast. And this is one. I love it. Teach some kids how to enjoy each other's company without being fast. I don't care. I don't fuck with it. <laughs> no, not at nine. Not at nine. Not at nine. Not at nine. Maybe in a group setting, we can have a group setting and everybody do their thing in a group setting as far as everybody play, 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 play in a group setting. But a one on one play date, I'm not rocking with. I don't care. This person says, Funny how everyone's saying what's the issue, but it was two little boys and girls, and it, it's an agenda, or they too little, too young to know what they are that they are gay. No one this age should be going on dates, supervised or not. It's okay to have friends and go hang out, but mom's literally saying, My daughter's boyfriend is not okay at his age. I agree because that's exactly what be going on. What would be said in the comments? Stop pushing sexuality on children. That's what they would be saying. Now, me, myself, personally, in discussions that I had, I said 12, 13, when they have matured more and these discussions start to be coming like, you know, more of a real thing. We had to talk about these things now. Puberty done hit. We got to start talking about shit. Maybe at that age, I will be more open to it. But nine, hell no. Below 10, elementary school, hell no. Another guy. What happened to letting kids be and not forcing sexuality on them? You see how the men are coming? Okay, so here come some ladies though, you know. Um, I'm all for kids having crushes at school, but taking them out on a mini little date is a no for me. Too young. A boyfriend at nine years old is wild. The things people do for social media is no way she thinks this is okay. And I'm pretty sure T.S. Madison, who is a trans woman, is saying, but if there were two kids that claimed to be that they were LGBTQ, there will be an issue. But okay, I'm going to go ahead and leave the situation alone. Um, y'all let me know what y'all think about this comment section below. I ain't folding on this. I think that could wait. That could wait. But that's the thing. The majority of people in this comment section are all for it. 
if this was a man blog, I'm pretty sure it will be different. So, fellas, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Hopefully, the sound allows this to come on to my main channel, but it may be on a backup channel, so you may just be seeing on here. But I want to see what people think about this. I really want to, so I still may put it up, even if it's copywritten, because I just want to see what y'all thoughts are. Shout out to Sammy, though. That's the reason why I can't play it on my main channel, because the song playing in the background. I like the way that's a classic, man. That's a Florida boy. Shout out to you. But um, next story, though. Hold up, hold up, hold up. That was a clip from my go to series black twitter watch the entire episode by either clicking the card above or the links in either the description or the pinned comment and be sure to subscribe to the black twitter channel